And Liz Perner from the Fox Valley Command Association joins us with Here's Copper. There's Copper. And, and Liz, before we talk about Copper, mm -hmm. uh, let's talk about because we um, had a little promo and we had a cute, cute dog. We had two dogs, really, mm -hmm. Princess and Diana. Were they related? They were. They were sisters. They came from the same family, and we were lucky enough to find a home that would adopt both of them so yeah, they we, could stay together. We were expecting to, to have them <laughs> on today, but you know what? That, that uh, comes by your desk, and it looks like a perfect fit, and you, you, you want to adopt them out to a great family, right? Exactly, exactly. I think they caught wind that they were going to be the tail wagger, and they put on a show to get it done. Uh, yeah, there you go. They were, they were cute, but we also have Copper, yeah. who's cute now. How did you get Copper? Copper came to us. Uh, the family had a new baby in the home, and it was a little much. So he came to us, and we're looking to find a forever home that's going to give him lots of attention because he's a lap dog. He likes to be around people. How about animals? Do you have if you have another cat or dog in the house? Absolutely. It always depends on the other animal. Um, Copper is great with other dogs. Again, he is he likes the attention of humans most, but he would do fine as long as the other dog would get along. And is he um, a, just a regular Chihuahua? Regular, just a, a regular a Chihuahua though? Yeah, he's a Chihuahua mix. We think a little bit of mini miniature Pinscher in there as well for him. What kind of grooming? Grooming, he's not going to require too much nail trims, uh, making sure his ears are clean. You know, regular grooming, but nothing too high maintenance. On and I. I talk about this all the time with cold days and such but they're just such little dogs it's a good idea to put something on them when you take them out for a walk right absolutely we had we took his jacket off but in this cold weather a jacket is going to be crucial for him to keep his body temp up so how about as far as the paws too anything with that paws? or not well definitely you could try booties for some dogs some are not tolerant <laughs> um, the best thing is just keep an eye on them when they start to hold their fo their feet up it means their feet are getting cold and it's time to come in so. And you have some great news. I mean, you have a great holiday giving uh, mm -hmm. news to talk about. And, and Well, tell us about that. Well, we just wanted to take the opportunity to say thank you to everyone who participated in our giving campaign um, over the holidays. It was really successful. We were able to save lots of lives. And I'm really happy to announce that because of everyone's um, hard work and devotion to our organization, we adopted 100% of our adoptable animals. So we're very Fantastic. excited about that. Liz, thanks very much. And if you want to adopt... Uh, copper or any of the adoptable animals there at Fox Valley Humane Association's Animal Shelter, call 733-1717 or go to our website. Look at that face. <laughs> FoxLivingOnline.com. We have a link to theirs as well. Just click on Good Day Wisconsin. We'll be right back.